The Speaker recognizes Representative Barnett. If, if I may, I would like to speak to this amendment and the next one offered at the same time. Thank you very much. Colleagues, this bill is the first time we're going to be taking up any legislation which purports to do something to help many patrons in our restaurants who suffer severe allergies, sometimes culminating in anaphylactic shock that can proceed to death. I think this bill is a move in the right direction. However, I don't think it goes quite far enough. And that is why I am offering the following amendment, that beginning two years after the effective date of this amendatory act, that a food service establishment shall prepare and retain on site of the food service department a list of all ingredients in each item of the dish offered on the menu. This is not that we want to publish whatever recipes there may exist. But when somebody comes into a restaurant and is speaking with a server and mentions an allergy, it is incumbent upon us in the state to protect the health, safety, and welfare of all of the patrons of that restaurant and to have on file a list of the ingredients in the restaurant that are in that particular item so that a server with good faith can go back, look and see what ingredients are in that item, and come back and tell the guests of the restaurant so that nobody suffers undue harm. And since we are about to change the culture, and that's what this bill is about, I suggest also in another amendment that we tie bar this bill to House Bill 5804, the changes in the Elliot Larson Civil Rights Act, which would protect gay, lesbian, and transgender individuals who are seeking public accommodation, their livelihoods, and their business opportunities in the state of Michigan. If this is indeed solely about culture, then let's proceed the right way about culture. If this, on the other hand, is solely about allergies, then I, ex then I would expect that my Second Amendment would be ado adopted. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. The question is on the adoption of the amendment. The clerk will open the board. The amendment is not adopted.